Hello there. Welcome to my very first tutorial video on how to capture the screen activities on your Mac machine along with the audio using freely available uh, QuickTime player which you can open through the Spotlight Search app uh, or by going to the Launchpad and then uh, to the corresponding folder which is this one for in my case and simply double clicking this QuickTime player icon or just I said before you can open spotlight search either by clicking this little lens thing or simply pressing command space together uh, that will open the spotlight search and you can type the name of that app you can do the same also when you have the uh, launchpad and you can type the name of this app here okay so let me open the app double click and then you will see that the, the icon will show up here as well as the menu bar for the app will show up here once it's open go to file and select new screen recording that will open this uh, control panel uh, with <coughs> the record button as well as this little button that will show you various options for the microphone <coughs> as well as <coughs> whether we want to um, record the mouse clicks and uh, movement initially it may not be selected uh, like the internal microphone uh, it was known in my case so uh, you need to select the internal microphone and then uh, and after you are done with that um, you click on this record button the recording has not started yet it will start once you click on this gray area or when you drag a certain part of the window uh, so for example if you click on this one I will start with the option of recording only part of the window so I'm dragging this and you define which area how much area to cover in your recording when you click on this one it will start recording so in this area whatever is visible my my mouse my clicks or anything for example this is the launcher that i opened earlier only this white area without uh, this chess or activity monitor or bootcamp assistant etc will be recorded now once you are done with uh, your activities you can stop the recording by going to this stop button i forgot to tell you that that stop button doesn't show up until you select start recording button so when you hit the record button you will notice that this little thing started to show up this is a stop button for your recording it is not activate because you have not really started the recording process but when you start the recording process this will become darker uh, indicating it's active now and you can click that and stop the record now because i wanted to select the whole screen i'm going to click this one so now this stop button is now active and i'm opening my launcher now all of these apps first page second page third page <coughs> these will all be visible in the new video that i am recording here all these apps um, different app holders within the launcher now and uh, let me stop that uh, recording process and make a file out of that so it opened uh, the, the video that we just recorded and now you can just play here before saving or you can save it and then uh, play that video and uh, now you can you can hear my my sound my voice uh, on the background the that's the recorded uh, voice of mine um oh uh, sorry um cancel i want to now save this video i don't want to lose what i recorded so for that go to export and select the highest possible uh, pixels here I will I will just uh, say quick time quick time recorded video and uh, just save it 
and replace it because uh, I want to overwrite the existing file so uh, that's how you do that so I hope uh, you can now do the same with uh, a QuickTime player in your machine thank you for watching my video and see you next time okay uh, next I want to show you how to do the same uh, same work of uh, recording your screen activities with the audio show using a free app in uh, Mac machine uh, the, the app is monosnap and you can download it from this uh, website I simply click it so here is the link once I click that uh, we can install that from the app store uh, because it's already installed in my machine uh, uh, it is showing open but uh, when uh, it's not installed already <coughs> you'll have the option of uh, installing it um, through through the app store so uh, once uh, you have installed it um, you it will show up in <coughs> both uh, the uh, launch pad here right? this is the icon um, uh, you can also uh, open it from the spotlight search um, let's type uh, mono snap as you can see it it has come at the top and you can simply double click here or you, you could have done the same from the launch pad as well uh, when you have done that there will be this icon showing up now simply click that mono snap icon uh, now uh, you can select uh, record video you could also uh, simply make a photo snapshot of the screen whole screen or uh, part of the uh, certain area of the screen but uh, right now what i'm trying to do uh, okay so for example I, I can show that as well uh, capture a screen when I did that it, it has captured because I'm using dual monitor system you have both screens in a single snapshot uh, and you could save it um, by going here and then save okay, this is a simple still picture likewise you can again click here and just uh, you, you may want to capture a certain part of the screen so I just want to make a snapshot of this area of the screen see this is what is snapped and now just like before you can save it or I don't want to save it again uh, my main goal here is to show you how you can record a video and to do that um, now um, I, I will click it here that will open me an uh, active area like this one and there is this record button now you have not started recording yet um, you will start recording once you click uh, this record button now you have a choice of how where or how much um, to record um, I mean you you can uh, make the whole screen cover like this or uh, by making it smaller you can <coughs> record some part of the screen as only um, here um, there are settings I don't know if you noticed that before the settings um, you have set the choice of uh, how many frames per second to record uh, I would want uh, the best quality so 60 frames per second um, again uh, high quality I want um, I want to capture the uh, mouse cursor as well as mouse clicks um, yeah, if you want to show your face you can you can uh, do that by selecting um, this uh, face time as the camera option as well I don't in this video I don't want to show myself on, on the video uh, I'm not that important here but you have to make sure you have selected built-in microphone on, on these two now um, because I'm 
trying to demonstrate my activities that may occur in the in this screen so I want to cover the whole area of the screen so now I'm almost ready uh, uh, I'm ready now so let me click this button and it will start recording and you notice here the time and this icon telling you that uh, the video record has already started you also have a choice of this thing not to show on this uh, screen while you are recording some important work um, that may be a distraction for others so uh, <clears throat> if you want to bring it back later you can do that um, <coughs> simply by clicking here um, now uh, I, I have put it on the side so now you can do have your activities here for example I'm simply opening my launcher third page second page first page um, I don't want to uh, make a big video here uh, doing a lot of activities um, that you, you can understand that uh, uh, this thing will be recorded in um, <coughs> And uh, that's what uh, you need, you want. Uh, now uh, you have a choice of pausing and then recording again, um, or simply quitting the whole thing. But what I want to do is uh, I want to finish recording and save the record as a file so that I can watch it later or do whatever I want to. <coughs> so I finished recording and. Um, <coughs> After that, it gives me this window. <coughs> now you can play <coughs> whatever has been recorded. So that's what was recorded. Um, see, well, that was the activity um, on this screen. Um, now <coughs> I can save it. So um, click on the save. Here you can change the file name. And I want to save it at a place of my choice. So I'm saving it here. Um, and that's that's it. That's how you save it. So now hope. You, you can do that as well. Um, uh, thanks for watching and enjoy your video recording. See you next time.